said I love you, wouldn't put no one above you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That should never ever worry you. That should never ever worry you. Always gotta stay 100 and true. Yeah. The only time I lie is when I lie with you. Yeah. Put my pride to the side and then I slide with you. What's going on, Slender Fam? If you're new to our channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button, comment down below, turn on our post notifications so you're notified when we upload a new video. What she said. Yes. So we just want to take the time out before we get into today's video to just say thank you for all our supporters who yes. are continuously liking, um, commenting, having people subscribe to our channel. Sharing our videos. I saw some yeah. people comment that they've been sharing our videos. Um, we really, really appreciate it. Let's finish out 2018, you know, stronger than ever. You know, we're really excited for the new year and new content, what's going to yes. come on our channel. Yeah, 2019 um, is going to be I mean, if y'all just sitting here watching us and you're not subscribed yet, you might as well subscribe now because you're gonna subscribe eventually. So as you can tell by the title of the video, which says we have chose the location of our amazing wedding that's going to be coming very soon. We'll get into where we chose, but let's talk about why. Yes. We're choosing this location. So we're going to start talking about why we chose this location. And then y'all start commenting down below if you think you know where we chose. Yes. If you watched some of our older videos, you kind of know we were going back and forth between the East Coast and the West Coast. So you can just comment that. East Coast, West Coast. So let's get into it. So number one, which was like the deciding factor of where we are going to have our wedding is the weather. Yes. Yes. So where we're having our wedding it's pretty much good weather all year long. Um, there are some seats, there are some points in time where yeah, no, maybe it's, it's like rainy all season year. It's not all or year long. gloomy season. Um, not all year long. No, it's no like place, few months. No place exists that has all year round like perfect weather. Yeah. But it's pretty close. Yes. So, um, you know, that was like a huge deciding factor because of what we want to capture at our wedding is like to have that outdoorsy, indoorsy feel. And I mean, this has to be the perfect location to be able to accomplish that, I would say. Yeah. I think that was like a, yeah, that was our number one reason for sure. We went back and forth a lot because obviously there are pros and cons to doing either location, mm -hmm. but this one ended up coming out at the end just because we have more, I think we have more options here. That's really yeah. what it was. Like we had more options as to like when we wanted to have it. Like, um, also like different scenery. It's like we just have endless amounts of yeah. like sceneries and different views that we could get based off different locations in this you know place yes um, um that's still, this is tricky because i still if based on what we're saying i i could go either way i don't know what we're talking about um number two second reason why um it's the most cost effective way for yeah. us to have our wedding at this location yes. um you know with Weddings come, you know, if you're doing it, whether it's on one coast or another, it can be very costly yeah. um, to travel back and forth. And so that was another reason of why we chose this location. It's the most cost effective way to do what we want to do. Was that two or three? Because I feel like I said one. They just try to take mine. She tried to like say that. Said? I said that we had more like options. But that was tied into the weather. I guess. Okay, I you guess. Yeah, do we though? Like, I okay, definitely I guess this one is number three. So, one this was the weather. Three. Yes. Two was options. Yes. Three that's not the weather. is cost effective. Really, what it boils down to is. Yeah. Those three, those three things. I mean, yeah, ultimately, because everything else, I mean, you can just get anywhere. Like, mm -hmm. you can always get somewhere to make you a cake. You can always get somewhere to do flowers, all that kind of stuff. Um, so, yeah. So, wait no longer. We're just going to tell you our wedding. 2020. Yeah, I heard that. 20. 2020. Soy in Asia. Tie the knot in Los Angeles, California. Hey. Hey. We have chose hey. LA as our destination wedding. For those that are on the East Coast, they will be traveling here to see us get married in Los Angeles. 
Yes. And honestly, we went back and forth about what works best for us. Yes. And I was really thinking about like family, travel, and I'm like, wait, we put hold everyone on. else before us, honestly. Yes. But we put everyone else's possible wants and needs before we thought about like, well, what do we want out of this? And what do we want to like, you know, have for our special day? Mm -hmm. And when it comes down to it, for us, we really think LA is where we want to be for this special occasion. And basically, you know, if people can't come, we understand that obviously, like, traveling is not. She always yawn him when I'm talking, y'all. She always yawn him. Um, so, yeah, obviously, traveling is not the most convenient for some people. And maybe because of this, like, people may not be able to come. Which, you know, I mean, that's unfortunate, but we completely understand it. We never hold that against anyone. Against yeah. anyone. But for the people who are able to come, it's going to be a freaking movie. It's going to be a movie. It's going to be so much fun. I just feel like we have like endless opportunities and like the endless possibilities out here for where we can have it. And um, yeah, I just, I think it's going to be a lot of fun. So also, um, you know, I'm a very visual person and I just know myself that I would have been traveling back and forth to New York probably five, six times and up into the wedding to make sure everything has goals, goals as planned. With having our wedding here where we live, it's just so easy for us to yep. be able to go to the venue, check things out, yep. meet with a planner, whether or not we're gonna get a planner, that'd be a whole nother video mm -hmm. on whether Comment down below though, if y'all are in the LA area, even just any Southern California area, and you know of a wedding planner that's really good, um, but also not trying to be like LA bougie, like let me know, yeah. comment down below if y'all know anyone. And you know, for me, like I said, I'm just very visual. I like to see things in person. I would never book a venue or book anything without physically seeing it. Like yeah. online pictures can say one thing, but then when you show up and you're like, this is that. not what I We've picture. done that for apartments. Yes. If you ever like, y'all, this is ever went not. to look at an apartment and the pictures is flawless. You're like, oh, this is bomb. Like, why is it only this price? And then you get there and you're and like, like uh, the area, the neighborhood, like this is horrible. And I just know that yeah, like I'm going to be very meticulous and particular about our wedding and how things need to be. So I, I just know that for my sanity and to not have a mental breakdown sanity. on our wedding day, let's just have it where we can, where we live, so I could just drive to the venue or yeah, just drive. Yeah, no, that's gonna be clutch. It's gonna be really, really. Yeah. Just, it's gonna be so much easier to have to fly back and forth. We'll get to, that would be the most cost effective and honestly just our best option all around yeah and then really what that means is that all of 2019 is going to be planning yes like so we're just going to be that's why we said 2019 is going to be epic because like y'all going to see all the planning we're going to share the journey with you guys take yes. you along when we like you won't see the venue we'll say no, that that's going to be a surprise that's not going to be to the very end we don't want to ruin it for y'all yeah. um we may show you other venues that we did decide on though. Yes. So that way you kind of see, you know, what LA has to offer venue wise. Yeah. Um, but we won't show you the one that we decide on. Yeah. Cause then that way I want you to be like on the actual day. Cause you yeah. know, we're going to be vlogging that. Well, we're not, we're, we're going to have, we're gonna have people vlogging. We're going to have videographers and stuff. So y'all know when y'all see everything, you'll be like, wow. Yeah. Wow. I'm really excited. Um, obviously I've never planned a wedding before. Me either. I mean, so, I've, I've never planned anything with like up this, I mean, well, my bad. That reason. <laughs> Engagement, I would say you played something like, <laughs> how time. dare, y'all can't even watch that yet. Go ahead and watch that engagement video. It's all the new subscribers on the channel. Go ahead and watch that. Even if you watch it, watch it again. Go ahead and watch it again. Family, and really, I want to want it to be a surprise for everyone. Like this yes. wedding is like, yeah, my family's gonna be a part, but there's gonna be certain parts that we're not gonna disclose until the wedding days. Cause we just want people to be like, wow, and then like floored to see like, this is their wedding? Like, are they kidding right now? Stop what you're doing right now. Just comment down below if you're excited for this. If you're excited to be part of this, and we'll be, like Asia said, including y'all every step of the way. So as soon as we figure out, you know, a venue, we'll let y'all know we have a venue. And then obviously once we have the venue, we'll have the date, which means y'all will know yes. when, when the date is. Yeah. Um, Just know the year is definitely 2020. Yes, 2020 um, is the year we're gonna stick to it. For us, it's like, there's no rush. Like some people are like, when are y'all getting married? When are y'all getting married? We already been together for seven years. Like we already feel married. Um, you know, I don't think per se, marriage is gonna change necessarily the way we feel about each other. It's just gonna more so like solidify Fire. that like this is a union now and like a, a lifetime partnership yes. um so for us it's like we want to take our time we want to make sure it's what we want 
out of a way, not what everyone else wants. And I think that's the takeaway key, the point of this video is that you have to plan things for yourself and yep. what works for you. On your own timeline. what makes you happy and not like feeling them pressured. Cause I know for a fact that when, when we got engaged, oh, I felt goodness. pressure. We felt really pressured to hurry up and have this wedding because everyone was like, when are you getting married? When are you getting married? What's the date? What's the date? Like, and it's like, it's we like, were like trying to plan it. Like we were like, okay, well we need to figure out a date. Like, and then we're like, hold on. Let's say we step back yeah. and let's actually enjoy, enjoy our engagement. Yes. Who says that there needs to be a time step or there's after no, you get engaged to when you get married? Oh, no, y'all. There's no clock. There's no countdown. Like, literally do everything on your own timeline, on your, at your own pace. Like, obviously, we know each other very well, so we can tell one each other, like, when we're stressed out or when, like, you know, we need to take a step back and reevaluate a situation. And we realized pretty early on, honestly, it was maybe a month or so after the engagement, everybody was like, so when is it? When is when is it? And we're like, breaks like we'll let you know when it is when we decide that we're gonna have it and that's yeah. just what it is and then now y'all know 2020 Los Angeles California, Los Angeles, California will be our wedding you said it it's crazy we're sharing it with the world this is the first time we've been we're announcing no one to everyone that this is where our wedding is gonna be so for us like obviously January 2019 we're gonna hit the ground running and just be like full force trying to figure yeah. out venues and everything else so yeah, I mean, comment if you're excited. Like this if you love getting wedding updates from us. We're trying to keep y'all in the loop as much as we can. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, let's show some love. Yes. Um, and we cannot end this video oh. without I guess so. the special, oh. epic, oh. over the top, Yo. me saying it's <laughs> you Tammy thank you for watching subscribing commenting something positive on our last video as always you know we love you thank you for being part of the soldier fam yes and if you want a chance to be a part of next week's super subby shout out what do I have to do comment down below something positive about this video okay make sure you hit that like button of course make sure you subscribe to our channel yeah. and then make sure your post notifications are turned on it's so simple it's so simple yes. stay along for the journey and as always we'll be back more videos. Bye!